This won't take him out on the first shot, but I am going to do this up here. I'm not going to do that guy yet. Let's find out where that hog went. Okay. Oh, wow. What's up, everyone? This is your man, the Beard King, bringing you another episode of Seven Days to Die for Noobs, Alpha 17.1. In our last episode, we started constructing our horde base, similar to something shared by our Aussie friend, Jawoodle. We ran out of cobblestone and went on a resource grind to find some more. We looted a few construction sites and found something I did not want to tangle with. I am running out of good food, so in this video, we're going to go find some ingredients for my favorite recipe, wild boar and eggs, otherwise known as bacon and eggs. I'll provide links to my playlist and other videos if you haven't watched those yet. And also, if you haven't done so already, don't forget to click that subscribe button and feel free to comment below. So without further ado, let's get into it. The other thing I want to do is we need more meat. Um, I don't have very many eggs. I think I might have four, so that's going to be a problem. I'll have to you know, just go on a grind to find eggs. I won't bore you with that. But I definitely want to get some meat. At least with meat, I can char it if I have to. Um, and I have it marked up with a with an X on my mini map. I think there's a barn over there, and usually I'm able to find some hogs inside a barn. So uh, we're gonna do that today. Go visit the barn. It's you know it's 5:45 in the morning, so we have a full day worth of light here to get some stuff done. Um, I did start to harvest my aloe veras, my potatoes, and I have a couple of blueberries and some mushrooms. Um, didn't do it all. Figured I could talk about stuff with you guys while I'm doing this. Bummer. That's still a thing. Uh, yucca's easy. You can just keep your head up and go right down the path. Same with corn. So tall. I don't have a lot of corn. Um, I think I had said, yeah, I need to make this 16 deep. I do. Increments of 4. So... And I'm not, I'm not putting these blocks down to keep anybody out. It's... I just do it. You know, I don't know. I don't have my hoe on me. Uh, but I do have some yucca fruit. So. I can only make one there. Aloe vera. Make a couple. Potatoes. Come on. There's two. I don't have enough blueberries on me to do anything, so. I mean, farming's kind of fun for me. It's it's nice to slowly get there, if you will, right? Oh, I have enough seeds. I can add two more aloe veras. Oh. oh. What else did I... Oh, I didn't... I don't have enough of anything else. Okay. And I need to get my hoe anyways. Might not do that in this video. It's just farming. You guys all know how that works. What I'm going to do here... Come on. Is I'm going to clean out my inventory. And I think we will go get some hogs first. So. Okay, guys, I have that all sorted out inventory wise. Uh, while, while I was up there, I found a couple of more aloe veras, a potato, and a yucca, and a corn. So I made the seeds, I planted them. I grabbed my hoe and I. Exp expanded my garden by one more block so that should give me 16 just enough to make four seeds if that's what I need to do so anyways right now we are heading over to a what I think is a good barn location to find some hog meat this is where I've been collecting all my clay over here to make cobblestone oh what was that Metal Spike Mod. Craft high-tech mods to weapons and armor. Oh, that's cool. I can make a spiked club. Forge steel, I do not have any of that. 
That is pretty sweet. I don't think I have enough springs either. Alright, well, I'll have it. I'll get it in time. Egg? No egg. Oh, hey. <laughs> uh, I'm down here digging for clay. There's a giant farm full of blueberries up here. Outstanding. I mean, it's not a bad sized plot to just put a farm down. Good, I got an egg. But I like my little farm over there. I like to I like to come out onto my little observation deck up there and take a look at my garden and see how how my crops are doing. I always line them up in a row. Corn. Yucca. Usually a bushy thing like blueberries would be good. Anyways, from, from tall to short. And I keep the tall towards the back of the primary direction that I'm facing. It's just me. Cool. I don't think I've eaten one blueberry because I'm always saving them. Let's make the rest. Alright, outstanding. Alright, here, there's the barn. You can see it. Oh, I've got a little forged iron. I don't have any regular iron. I... Hopefully my club doesn't get beat down too far to where I can't use it. And I am paying attention to the ground in case I see more nests. Just to go get some eggs. Okay, so we have a dead item here. What did I put that point in? Well, did I say I was going to save it? What was I saving two points for, people? I can't remember. What was I saving it for? Bummer. Can't remember. Got some children of the corn over here. Taking a nap. Oh, one hit. A one hitter. That was my first sneak attack. One hit. Can I do it again? Nope. Take it. Take those corns while I'm at it. Okay. This barn can have quite a few fun little scenes in it. The light's here. So, that means you're supposed to enter here. We will go through this the way we're supposed to. By following the lights. Oh, the hogs are outside. Hmm. I mean, that's what I came here to do. They don't mess with you, though, if you just are in here, to my knowledge. But, okay, good. So we know we have hogs. Let's loot this base. Or this outpost. Of course, I didn't bring my shovel. This place has a lot of resources in it. Let's clean it out. And then I can make a run back to my base, get my shovel, and I can come back out here. I need more concrete. I need more cobblestones. You know, I am in the process of building that base, so... I can hear them sleeping. This is a place where they drop down on top of you. There's one. No, oh, there's a big girl. She's probably gonna... Call her friends. It's fine.
What level am I? 18. I just need two more levels to get to 20. I wonder if I can do it before the Horde Knight arrives. I will loot this stuff down here while I'm here. Okay. I know there's somebody sleeping right, right in there. Don't know if I can get to him. I don't know if I can shoot through here. Let's see. Nope. Can't. Okay. It's okay. I know that there's some Zeds up there. I am going to pick up this hay bale. And I'll show you why when, when I get back. Nice. One hit wonder right there, people. They're up there. That's probably him right there sleeping. Yeah, there's there's a head. There's a foot or something slipping through. Not sure what's in here. Oh! A sneaky bugger. Ah, oh, there's two of them. Thing I've left. Those tight spaces, man. They'll get you every time. Alright. Nice. I mean I have a I have a higher level shotgun already, but those extra shells is great. Kinda looks like there's something back there, doesn't it? Oh, it's the outside. Alright, never mind. Rip, rip. Nope, nobody here. Loads of resources. Nothing in the suitcase. Alright. Let's get up here and see what we have. There's another le level. There's another level up there. I don't see anybody down here. I don't see what I thought was somebody sticking through. Maybe it was that tall guy that I just took out. Maybe that was him sleeping, or maybe it was just the trash. I don't know. Who knows? Scrap. Okay. Scrap that, that, that. And that. And that, one of those, yeah, that'll give me three. Okay, I'll be able to fix my club here in a minute. If I need to. I, I try to let it go to totally destroyed before I up or repair anything. I don't... And it's a resource game for me right now, so there they all <laughs> there they are. Is there anybody hiding back here? Any any little nappers back here? No. Medical pile. Alright, whatever. Didn't wake anybody. Who should I take out first, big girl? Let's go with her first. Is she gonna walk across? Is she gonna walk the plank or is she just gonna just gonna walk the plank? And I'm gonna miss. She's not gonna walk the plank. Alright. Have a nice fall. Let's see if we can get this guy. Shh, the ladder's right here, so. They do come up, that's where they're coming from. Let's go over here and Loot this. It'll take him a while to get up here. Okay, thank you very little for that. What's in here? Okay, that's the water purifier mod. That's pretty good. You can. I think I might already have one of those. I'm not sure, but you can stick that on your in your helmet or whatever, and it'll it'll filter the water for you. So you don't need to boil them. And we got some tools. Man, I'd love to get an iron axe right now. Iron fire axe, that would just be wonderful. Nails. Right. Food. I could go for some food, but maybe it'll just have a bunch of plastic for me. Let's 
plastic. That's some water. It's okay. Got a drink. There's a nice meat stew. I'll take that for sure. Okay. There was another entrance up here. Not really. Let's get back over here. Where are those clowns at? They're just wandering around. They haven't made it up here that far yet. I need a crouch. Okay, she's down. Uh, where? That's my base. Now that's my base. So the pigs. Hogs are out back. Let's drop down. Don't know where that other guy went. Not here. Okay. Alright. Uh, pretty weighted down, but the base isn't that far away. There's only two hogs. I didn't nerd pull up anything. This won't take them out on the first shot, but I am going to do this up here. I'm not going to do that guy yet. Let's find out where that hog went. Okay. Oh, wow. He can get me all the way through there. Great. Yeah, I know. I hear you. I hear you. Come on. I got a hog to get. Oh. Ah. Oh. Feel something coming on. Boy, that seems to be the story of my life. I don't know if you guys noticed, um, I haven't had that feeling of a sickness coming on for quite a while. At some point it just went away and I didn't even not notice it. And now I've got it back. Isn't, isn't that wonderful? Let's take this shot right here in the head. Boom. Oh, you want to stop? Well, I, you know, hey, I don't, I don't have any problems with that. Get my arrows, get some meat. Outstanding. There is a perk or a skill point you can get uh, that allows you to harvest even more off of animals. I don't have it. I just have other priorities right now. Okay. Pick up these bales. Very good. I'm running right now. Running slow. We're going to head back. We're going to drop off all of this stuff that we need and then gonna get the shovel and come back and I'm picking up all this cobblestone and concrete okay we're back uh, sorted through my inventory grab my shovel I kept my blueberry seeds on me we might as well go get those planted and that works it's a little little short but it works so I don't have to come down this anymore just a quick quick rundown so, I've been putting blueberries up here, and I have a mushroom seed. So, let's move the mushroom seed. Get a blueberry in there. And we'll get these planted. We have a whole row of blueberries. 
That's wonderful. And one to spare. And I put the mushroom. That's potatoes. Ah, whatever. The mushroom's right there. Whatever. I can't. You know what? I'll plant it. Why not? Whatever. Okay. We are heading back to get the resources. This has all been upgraded to concrete. It'd be great to do reinforced concrete, but I just won't have enough resources to get that done. I am pretty close to leveling, so I will take... I will take any opportunity I can to clean out the riffraff. Oh, she was a tough old bird. And I know there's this guy over here. lag there. Weird. My my machine's pretty powerful. And I'm running a 1080 Ti. It's an i7 770 or whatever. It's 32 gigs of RAM. Um, it's, a, it's a powerful machine, so any time that I get a lag like that, I have to wonder if something just spawned in on me, like a wandering horde. So if I was kind of jerking around like this, I, you know, just never know. So anyways, this is what we came here to do. Get the resources. Cobblestone. I don't think there was any back here. Oh yes, there was. There's no water in there, and we have some concrete to get. My stamina is smoked. I don't have any water on me. I think I wanted to go over and check out where that car had blown up in the pawn shop next to my garden to see if that was water. I thought I saw that back there. So, that would be cool. Yes, I know about the infinite water loop, or the infinite water trick. I don't know if that has been patched. Alright, level 19. I have two skill points. Now what was it that I was supposed to put those two points in? Let's take a look. I said I was going to save that point for something. What was it? Was it this? Was I saving it so I can craft good quality items? Then get to level 20 and put a point into crafting iron tools but my question was is this a two point thing or is this a one point thing I don't remember don't remember I mean it's it's I've got almost a full day more or less between now and horde night you know I, I know I can level up another level Maybe I'll save the save these points again. Is that what I should do? Just keep keep these three these two points and ding to level twenty, so I have three skill in for my iron tools right away, so I know I have it. And if it only takes one point, if this only takes one point, then I just drop spend the other two points here. Craft good quality items, that means I can get up to level 4 tools, I think. And I'll be able to do iron, so I'll be able to get a fire axe. I won't have to go looking for that anymore. You know, it's funny, I've been after a fire axe. I talk about a fire axe, fire axe, fire axe. I love the fire axe. 
for now. I love the fire axe. I can get wood with it. I can break down doors with it. And for a while, that tends to be my primary weapon against zombies, so I no longer have to carry my club. Now that might all change because I got that spiked club mod. I don't know how much a spike club does anymore. I haven't had that mod, so I haven't been able to compare it yet. Let's get that concrete. Out of breath. Out of stamina. It's so interesting. Day six for me, day six and, and the day of seven. Such an interesting time for me in this game because I have a lot of my skills planned out. You know, I have some decent tools. I've usually have found iron tools like I have right now. So I'm, you know, I'm doing good work there. Um, I know that horde's coming. I have a pretty good design going for the horde base. So I'm feeling positive about that. But the thing that's super exciting for me right now, day six and day seven, sitting where I'm sitting, is I know that after the horde comes and goes on, on after the night on day seven, I have another seven days where I can spend a little bit more time looting, clearing out some, doing some legitimate POI clearing, you know, explore some of those bigger places. It's just such a fun time. It's it's like the pressure of night seven is off. Still got night 14 lurking in the back of your mind though, so. But yeah, day, day eight, great. It's a great day. Day eight is great. Oh, my stamina. Now, I don't know about these. This is an appliance box. Um, I think you can get mechanical parts and electronics in here, I think. And I don't know if it's something that I should be wrenching on. I didn't get anything from that. What am I doing wrong? <clears throat> should I have been using my pickaxe on it? I don't know. I think it's a wrench thing. And I don't have a wrench. Hey, see that? Take that egg. I never hit these. I don't. I don't know what's in them. It's, you know, it's giving me the wood feedback. Is that all it is? Is wood? Does it change if I hit it? No. All right, whatever. Nothing back there. Some more concrete. Back to cobblestone. Plenty more over here. It's awesome. Somebody's walking around. Somebody just must have been banging on a car over there. I don't know if you guys could hear that, but I just heard an explosion. That's it. 
Okay, everyone. So to recap, today we just made a run over the hill to a barn, and found a bunch of bunch of uh, blueberries, and located the ingredients I needed for my favorite recipe: wild boar and eggs, otherwise known as bacon and eggs. I hope you enjoyed another video of Seven Days to Die for Noobs by me, the Beard King. I am creating a playlist of this series and working on my end screens, so if you missed the last episode, I'll have it linked here and in the description. If you haven't done so already, feel free to click that subscribe button and leave a comment. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you all next time.